Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. In this lecture series, we are going to see in detail about semiconductor devices. All the semiconductor devices I am going to discuss in detail, be it a two-terminal two devices or three-terminal devices. Two-terminal devices are diodes like PN junction diode, Zener diode, etc. And three-terminal devices are transistors like bipolar junction transistor, field effect transistor and so on. Also, I will be discussing about the thyristors. Thyristors are uh, of three types. They are SER, UJT and uh, TRIAC. So, we will start from PN junction diode. So, what is a PN junction diode? It is a semiconductor device which is able to conduct current in one direction. Unidirectional current or one directional current is allowed to flow or allowed to conduct in a PN junction diode. So, how will you operate a PN junction diode? Where will be it used? Where? What are the applications of a PN junction diode? Everything we will be seeing in detail. So, in this lecture, I am splitting up the explanation of PN junction diode into five parts, five main parts. Symbol, construction, modes of working, circuit diagram and VA characteristics. So, this will be easier for understanding and analyzing a PN junction diode. For students, when they are studying for their exams, it will be easy to understand how it works in a step by step manner. So, when you also, when you are studying for your exams or uh, you want to study the working or analyze its characteristics, split up into these individual components so that it will be easy for you. First, I am moving on to symbol of a PN junction diode. You have to be very clear and uh, precise that every semiconductor device or every circuitry component uh, has a symbol. For example, PN junction diode has one type of symbol. Zener diode has a symbol. We have to represent each and every semiconductor device or component by symbols. Symbols are short representation of what type of device we are using for this circuitry working okay so when going to the symbol this is the symbol of pn junction diode this is p region and this is n region so this is positive terminal and this is negative terminal so this can be given in the reverse pattern for two modes two main modes forward bias mode and reverse bias mode that we will discuss in further discussions so this is a component symbol of that component what is the makeup of that what is it made up of that we will go and see it in construction When you come to construction, this is the PN junction diode with the terminals coming from both these layers. We have to call them as layers, P layer and N layer. So there are some of the main terminologies when you talk about the Construction of a PN junction diode. First terminology is doping. Very important terminology. Doping is the injection of charge carriers into a layer. Injection of charge carriers into a layer. For example, in P layer, there are holes. In N layer, there are electrons injected in both the layers. Holes injected in P layer and electrons injected in N layer. This injection, other word for injection is called as doping. Mostly doping is a common word used in case of injection of charge carriers. Okay. Now doping. Next one is charge carriers. What do you mean by charge carriers? What are the charges universally available? Holes and electrons. These are the 
टू चार्ज कैरियर्स यूनिवर्सली अवेलेबल सो मेजॉरिटी देर आर टू अदर टू टर्मिनल टू टर्मिनोलॉजी मेजॉरिटी चार्ज कैरियर्स एंड माइनॉरिटी चार्ज कैरियर्स majority charge carriers and minority charge carriers so p layer has holes as a majority charge carrier n layer as a electron has majority charge carriers so in each and every layer p layer b p layer or n layer if there are majority charge carriers there will be minority charge carriers for example in p layer if holes are the majority charge carriers electrons will be the minority charge carriers similarly in n layer if electrons are the majority charge carriers holes will be the minority charge carriers so simply this is the construction of pn junction diode if i can draw this represent it these are the representation of holes in a pn junction diode this is the representation of electrons in a pn junction diode to differentiate between holes and electrons see here this i have drawn it as a circle and i have shade for holes and i have shaded the circle for electrons okay this gap is represented as holes in the circle these gaps are represented as holes these gaps of the circles there are holes and this is these are electrons okay so as i said holes are majority charge carriers in the p layer so there will be minority charge carriers some amount of minority charge carriers here holes will be the minority charge carriers so usually in pn junction diodes doping will be uniform in both layers so p layer and n layer will be doped by equal amount of majority charge carriers on both the sides in simple this is the construction of a pn junction diode thank you